Welcome to Alex Krulik's Magic Submitter software. I'm David Sprague and I'll be teaching you how to set up all your items in Magic Submitter through this training series and specifically this video I want to teach you how to set up your expression engine items. Now expression engine items is probably incredibly unique to most people but it's simply an expression engine is the type of technology that's used in what's called forum marketing. And forum marketing has a couple different facets to it. Uh, but let me just kind of give you a brief overview of what forum marketing is all about. Most people really think that when you do forum marketing, it's going into these forums and posting information and leaving a signature and maybe putting your link in your signature. And then when you post a lot of this stuff and you have a signature, then you get all these links that are you know, pointing to your main piece of content that you want to rank at the top of Google. That is not how forum marketing actually works in its, uh, in this sense at least. When we're using Expression Engine, Expression Engine is a, a lot like a WordPress software. It's a standard software it's a, um, that's used over and over. It's You can put it up at any time, but it's really designed for forums. And what it gives someone the ability to do is actually create a forum in any different niche almost instantly. So what happens in these forums is when someone actually registers, they create what's called a profile. And in a profile, you're allowed to tell about yourself, your interests. But the great thing about the profile is you also get to put a link in your profile. So what the purpose of an expression engine item is, or forum marketing is, is simply not to actually go in and create a profile and post information. It's simply just to create a profile with one link in it. And that link will get pinged automatically by Magic Submitter and then you'll get credit for that. So let's jump in a little bit to Magic Submitter so you can visually see what I'm talking. So I've got Magic Submitter open and I've clicked on Service Type Mat Expression Engine. You can see that there are 667 different Expression Engine um, forums that you can actually create profiles on. And I mean, it's an amazing amount of backlinks that you can get in one run. And as of now, and I don't have the update done, but Expression Engine is actually done on what's called sockets, so they're super incredibly fast to get all these different backlinks. And as you know, Magic Submit will automatically ping all these sites as well when you're done with them. So incredibly powerful feature. So let's take a quick drive in and let's actually look at one of these sites so you can see exactly what these sites look like. So you can see here I opened up a nashvillenews.org and you can see that's how easy it is. It's pretty much pretty straightforward. It looks like a, a forum software and this is where Magic Smear would put in your username, your password, your screen name, your email address and see here the URL which is incredibly powerful because this is what will give you those backlinks. So all you're doing is simply, let me open up Magic Submitter here, and you can see nashvillenews.org there, is simply creating a profile. Now, just to give you a little bit of insight on this, um, there are actually two different ways to create um, that this goes. Most people actually just create their profile, they put their, their uh, link in, but what happens is, is a, because this is such a prominent way to market, if there's a link, a URL inside your profile, when it's created, a lot of admins on these sites will come and just delete it right away. So, you know, you'll get a link for a couple days, but then it'll be taken away. So, what Magic Submitter has done is created a, a two step process. It's given you the ability to submit or to create the profile, but also a second set of commands, which actually submits a few weeks later. Uh, your uh, your link so what it does is when we look at this item you're gonna see that there's some different areas you can fill out and the reason is is because a lot of people do forum profile marketing and that's really the way it should be called a forum profile marketing and expression engine is one of those prominent softwares to use for forums and so all you're doing is creating a profile you know filling in the information and then not filling in a link and then this about a week or two later, you would actually go in and resubmit your profile with a link. And we find that those links stay a lot longer. Now, again, there are a lot of people that use, again, forum profile marketing, and they don't do this two-step process. So I, I want to reiterate, a two-step process is to submit your profile without a link, and then 10 to 15 days later, submit the profile again with the link. And let me show you what that looks like. So if we actually go into the main page, and click on manage items 
you can hear, hear the uh, plus sign there. You can see again on your left hand side that there is a project area that you can actually organize all your profiles. So what we normally do is we do one profile run per piece of content. And we actually use the profile runs now, which is a very powerful feature, in the campaigns mode to actually backlink our backlinks. So not to get too detailed into it, but if you want to have learn more about the campaigns, you can go into the campaign training that we have full details on. But what, what happens is if you've got, let's say you've got your money site, uh, which is a, a video, and then you backlink that with articles, you backlink that with bookmarks, you backlink that with some WordPress blogs, well, now you've got maybe 100, 200, 300 links linking into your YouTube video. Well, the way to get those links found is not just to ping them, but to backlink those backlinks. So you can use Expression Engine is a great way because there's 667 of them, and there'll be a lot more in the future that you can actually use these links to backlink your backlinks inside the campaign. So, so it's good to organize your projects as well. So normally we actually organize our projects into either company name or niches so if I've got company A, company B, company C and I know that with company A um, I'm actually going to do a profile run or company B I'm going to do a profile run on their main website so if I'm trying to get their main website ranked I would make a profile run so it's pretty simple to fill out number one you've got your occupation then you've got your bio and then you've got your bio with links so this should really say bio without links and so the beautiful thing about again expression engine you can actually put links inside now one of the things that's important is the links you actually put inside your bio needs to have a very specific type of forum markup language and if you want to get more information on this all you have to do is click on help and we've done a complete step-by-step -step training on your form marketing if you just scroll down and click on the VIP training and then you click Control F if you're in Microsoft. I'm sorry if you're in uh, Firefox, and you can type in forum. And you can see on July 13th we did a training, give you the insider secrets, powerful forum profile link building. And if you go into this, uh, let's just click on it real quick. See if we can see it real quick in here for you. Okay, so I found the spot, and you can see here. Uh, I'm just going to kind of pause it, and if I pause it, you're not going to be able to see it, but I don't want to talk over it. But see, you can see it says URL equals URL, and then let me whoop, let me put that back. Where are we at here? Okay, so you got URL equals, and then you put your URL there, and then you put your keyword here, and then you put a forward slash or close end URL. So that will give you actually your link inside the bio. So let's actually go back here so I can show you it one more time. So you can see this is your Expression Engine bio without links. This will be your Expression Engine bio with links. This is a URL that you can actually put with no problem. You can put this directly to anything that you want. I personally leave this Expression Engine URL out. I don't want any URLs whatsoever in my profile. I certainly don't want it to get deleted. And so then I'll put the you know year, month, the day I was born. And you know, try to make this as, as normal as possible. You know, occupation teacher, been teaching school for six years, you know, and and give at least, you know, at least uh, I would say a hundred words in these. That's you know, at least it looks a little bit more real. So when the admin comes along, they don't delete it. And then you're going to do the exact same. Uh, information in the bio with links except for this one you're gonna put a um, the code which is URL um, what was that again let me just take a look at it the close URL equals and then this slash alright so so I have my team do this it's been a while since I've actually done it there so so you're gonna put URL equals and then you can put www.site.com and then you're going to close it with a close bracket and then you put your keyword so this would be like dentist Atlanta and then you're going to put the other close bracket and you put a forward slash URL and that's going to give you a URL on the expression engine form so so that's how you actually fill it out now on the right hand side here 
obviously I'm automatically assuming that you're you've got all your um, your category I'm sorry your uh, your sites are registered and then you want to make sure you fill out your categories now categories again are in magic submitter are blue and so you don't see anything blue in here so you don't really you don't have any categories to choose from you're not gonna have to worry about that and then let's do one take a look at one more time and then remember you can randomly choose between profiles I personally do not suggest to do this because um, because you, you you can only submit one link every single time so we do not use the random profile to submit to at least we don't because if you know if you chose remember since we're not doing we're not submitting content we're just creating one profile if you already created a profile for Bob and then the next time you use Bob again you create another profile it's you know I don't even know what would happen if that but so you don't want to do that so you do not want to use random profiles so simply put in your occupation put a cool bio in then put your bio in here with links uh, a link and then fill out your specific interests you like books you like hobbies you like taking walks on the beach and then you you're ready to submit this item and get 667 backlinks and literally a click of a button so that's how you use expression engine also make sure you use this strategy when you're using the campaign feature incredibly powerful take care and uh, we'll see you in the next training